Hey guys, what's going on? It's Greggles TV. Today we're gonna take a look at 4K video capabilities of the Fire TV Generation 2, 2015 version. And what we're gonna do is check out to see if it can play a 4K video. The video is encoded at 96 megabytes per second. We're gonna see if it stutters at all. We're gonna see if it plays it smoothly. So let's check it out. So just to show you that I am in 4K, I'm gonna go to settings. Display and sounds, display, and you can see video resolution is set up to 4K Ultra HD. If you plug this into a 10, uh, 1080p TV, you will not see that. So I have this into my 4K TV. Now I have two video players I can play this from. I'm gonna try it from VLC. And let's see if I can find the video on the SD card with this. So. And it looks like it did find it. So I am going to play it. And again, this is 96 megabytes per second. My computer cannot play this video. And I have a GTX 770 in there and it cannot play it. So it looks like it's playing it perfectly. Not, no stutter at all. Yeah, it stuttered right there. There we go. Let me fast forward it just a little bit here. Just to try to get to the fireworks. Otherwise, it's playing it really well. This is a really high resolution, um, high bitrate video file. And the, the Fire TV is playing it really well. Oh, stuttering right there. So it stutters every so often. I mean, if you get a 4K video through Amazon, it's going to play it smoothly because the bitrate is not going to be this high. But otherwise, it played it pretty smoothly. Let me just, sometimes it's the video player. So let me just go back to home. And what I'll do is I'm going to run it from um, ES File Explorer. All right, guys, so I'm in ES File Explorer. I'm going to select the video. It's asking me if I want to play it in the ES Media Player, Kodi, Photos, TVMC, VLC. So what I will do is I will, ch uh, I'm going to play it from, uh, I'm going to try it from the ES Media Player. And see if this plays it any better. Fast forward just a little here. See if it stutters. Because that's the other part of it is that the software has to be in synchronization with the hardware itself. So if there's anything that's not completely good with the software, then it's going to stutter. This one hasn't stuttered yet. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this was a uh, test of the, for, the Fire TV second generation playing 4K video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys down the road. Peace.